Surprise, sadness, some confusion, a lot of emotions on the campus of Kendall College of Art and Design tonight over the resignation of President David Rosen. 24-hour News 8's Henry Erb is live in downtown Grand Rapids with what he's discovering about this sudden development. David Rosen ran Kendall for less than two years. Neither Rosen nor officials at Ferris State University, which owns this school, are saying why Rosen is going now. We, uh, we are just devastated by, by his loss. Faculty Senate Chair Pat Constantine was close to tears when she told us why Rosen was so good for Kendall. He has done so many wonderful things for this school. We have really been progressing. Word about Rosen's resignation started leaking, and students created a Facebook page to support him. They even gathered on campus yesterday. According to some online posts, some of them see it as a power struggle over the independence of Kendall from Ferris State University. It was, everybody was really riled up over it. Rosen himself put out a statement assuring students that he was not fired, that he voluntarily quit in March, effective today, and that he's satisfied with the terms. Rosen told them the demonstrations were not in his best interest or that of Kendall. Still, there was no announcement from Ferris about the resignation until after we started asking questions today. And then it was mostly about Oliver Evans returning as interim president. We're really passionate about what we do, and he was just as passionate about what we do, and more specifically us, which was awesome. Like, he cared. He loved what we did, and he loved us. People here are shocked. They're upset. They don't know what's going to happen next. The faculty senate is holding an emergency meeting on Saturday to talk about it. Live downtown, Henry Earp, 24-hour news 8.